it takes quite the personality to make strangers cry with his death. Bob Hart, star of The Last Alaskans, lived a life whose stories would even make strangers cry, so think about the deep effect his passing has had on his fans. Bob Hart passed away on June 21st, 2017, surrounded by the closest of his friends and family. Bob Hart was diagnosed with cancer back in 2016 when he was 65 years old, but even at that age he gave cancer a tough competition. Nevertheless, he had to leave Alaska, which had been his home for around 44 years, ever since he first came here all the way back when he was just 21 years old. Fans bid a farewell goodbye to Bob Hart, who had to go live with his daughter, Talicia, and his granddaughter in town to help him around. Hart, whose tenacity of doing things his way first brought him to Alaska, swore as he left that he would travel all around America and further continue hunting for small game like quails as he left. However, even cancer couldn't stop Hart from preparing to return as soon as his health got a little better in 2017. Sadly, Bob could never return to his home as his health shortly after got worse. Friends and family actually gathered in his home in June 17, 2017 to celebrate his life unknown to the future that they would lose him in the same night. They were also able to encourage Bob to speak some final words to his fans and followers, and while in his weakened state, we couldn't understand most of what he was saying, but he kept repeating, I love you guys, again and again. It even had us teary-eyed, the fans we are sure were bawling their eyes out. A lot of them have reportedly not been able to still move on from his death to the legendary man, but the show must go on. Our condolences go out to his daughter Talicia, stepson Traver, foster son Steve, and wife Nancy that he leaves behind, as well as his dog Ruger, who he raised ever since he was a pup. Bob Hart lived a filling life making friends out of whomever he met, and surviving countless brushes with death including several plane crashes. As Plato once said about Cato the Younger, Bob Hart couldn't beat fate, but he nevertheless gave it a hard contest.